Good afternoon, guys. Today we're going to continue on with our run of Moemon. We'll have a quick look at what we got. So we have our Kadabra, uh, Quilava, Tyranta, Salamance, Kingdra, Dialga, and that's that's our list. So let's move on. Route 214 to Valstone City. There, behind you. I won't fall for that one again. Psychic Abigail with a Zubat. Alright, I got this. Sobe. Get dunked on, Zubat. Get dunked on. Correct. A level for Kadabra. We've got Shinx. Alright, Tyranto, you're up. And Rock Slide. Nice. Easy done. Another level for Tyranitar. I'm gonna Shellgon. The Shellgon is a dragon. I don't have any ice moves. I Fairy doesn't exist. So let's Dragon Breath it. With the Dialga. Shellgun looks like a Mega Man ripoff. Get wrecked. And we get a level 50 Alga. Nice. We take their money. Grab these weekly plants. We get a cherry berry, a citrus berry, a pomeg berry, and a chesto berry. Nothing here. Let's check it up here. Let's see in this cave. Ruin Maniac Cave. A Kyogre. That's that's a Kyogre. And you got a cool axe. Um. Oh, uh, I don't need you. Got TM Bone Ring. Nice. Kyoga is cute. All of them are cute. So I need to shift out. There we go. Put King Drop front. How you doing, doing Dawnlight? How you doing? Everyone calls me the Ruin Maniac. I don't care what they call me. I'll just keep on chipping away at the rock wall little by little. You know why? I am a ruined maniac who is fascinated by the unknown. I know it's a little sudden, but what about you and me have a race? You go and catch the unknown and I'll keep digging away. We'll have a race to see who can be done faster. All right, so that's not gonna be me because I haven't found any unknown yet. We've got a Mime Junior. Good to hear you're doing alright. We'll just run away from here. No need to murder a little child. At least not yet. Smash some rocks. Your choice scarf. Very nice.
Aha! Uh -huh. I found me a trainer. Challenge you to battle with the Pokemon I found. Ruin Maniac Brian with a Combuskin. It just so happens I have a Kingdra. A little bubbly beam you. It seems adequate. A Del Caddy. Oh, hello. Del Caddy is looking pretty nice. I approve. Kingdra's in love. Not the only one. Nice. I'll deal with you later. I'll take your money. I travel all over the world in search for mysteries. Ruin Maniac Ronald with an oddish. So let's toss out a twister. Mega Drain, can you stop? Thank you. And we get a level on Kingdra. And we beat Ronald. Switch into Yalga. Oh, wrong one. Switch in Yalga. There we go. Lake Valor. For the sake of my collection, I take on people I know I can't be. Hey, Nito Furiksu, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the lounge. You are now a sofa loafer. And I apologize for butchering your name. And that's what a collector does. Hey, Rainy, what's up? Collector Douglas with a Nito Queen. Ooh, Nito Queen looks nice. Give you a dragon breath. I'll take you down. And we get a victory bell. Hey Annette, how you doing? My day's been pretty good. I got to sleep until noon. Hung out with a friend on their stream and then went and got picked up the new Pokemon Pearl remake and now, now I'm streaming. I'm gonna gulpin. Working on the thing noise. Also good to be good. And we get a level on Dialga. Collector Douglas gets dunked on. And we take his money. Ooh, I see an item in that patch of grass. Which I'll get an encounter the instant I step into. Snova. You look way cuter than your Pokemon counterpart. I will be playing the Pokemon remakes. Uh, the re Pokemon remake on my debut stream next week. And then continue to play it every stream until I beat it. Krabby. Wow. 
Stardust. All that for some Stardust. I guess it's free money. That's fine. I like money. Vulpix. Looking cute. Nice luscious hair. So we've got some more trainers to beat up this path. Anorith, little schoolgirl. We'll, we'll leave you be, we won't destroy your life. And go to school in peace. Oop. Uh, item is here. Energy root. I'd sensed the presence of a trainer for a while. It was you. Psychic Mitchell. The Tangrowth. Tangrowth is looking quite nice. I approve. Alright, that, that, that bind was pretty pathetic. We dunk on you. We get a Taylor. Just hit you with a metal claw. One shot you. And we defeat Mitchell. Yeah, we'll keep in Dialga. Now this bit here looks like a secret item. There we go, Icy Rock. And a Meryl. Very cute. Ooh, Glaceon. You got ice skates, that's neat. Very impractical for the grass, but you do you. I'll fight you. Oh, a little kid like you is going to teach me about Pokemon? Oh, I'll teach you alright. Beauty Devon. With an Omanite. If only I had a grass move. But Dragon Breath. Oh, so close. Dragon Breath almost one shot it. And a Kabuto. Oh, you're cute. But not cute enough to not get killed. I'll metal claw you to the grave. I'm gonna star you. Alright, Kadabra, you can you can deal with the star you. And side beam. Nice. Dunked on lady. Hello there. What's that? You say you have a Pokedex? An authentic one? I sure do. We get Collector Brady. With a Wormadam. A little dragon breath. Pitiful critical hit, that's fine. I'm okay with that. Wormadan dies. 
Yeah, I'll go levels up. Need a Pidgeotto. Alright, Quilava. You need to get stronger. You need to evolve. And Flame Wheel. Yeah, I picked up a Dialga. Um, I was getting dunked on by the second gym leader's Palkia. Which was like three levels higher than the rest of my team. So I went looking for another Pokemon to, to boost my team and I found a Dialga and was like, all right, I'll try and catch it. And I caught it on like my last Pokeball. This run I have found probably like a dozen or so legendaries, but because they're all legendaries and I've only got Pokeballs, they're incredibly hard to catch. But I've come across a Dialga, I've come across a Kyogre, uh, Jirachi, Mew, Deoxys, Etran, um, Rotom. I guess Rotom's not really a legendary, but close enough. Uh, Suicune. Yeah, I've seen quite a few. Alright, so this Growlithe finally does an attack after just doing lowering stats. We get Togepi. More Flame Wheel. Ooh, we've got a burn, nice. And Collector Brady is dead. Actually, I am going to put a XP share on the Quilava so it can level up faster. Where are you at? There you are, XP share. We get a sacred ash. When I toss this coin, you call it heads. We battle, tails. We battle. Now, how will this play out, my friend? My guess is with a battle, because I'm big brain and I can work things out like this. Carlos, EI Carlos with a Blaziken. Careful, Blaziken. Your your underwear is showing. Give you a bite. Oh, my accuracy dropped. Oh, that's right, you're a fighting type. Whoops. It's fine. Goodbye, PI Carlos. You had a lot of money, nice. So that is everyone else fought on that route. Wait, did we fight this guy? Ooh, can't bike in there. To find my favorite Pokemon, I'll go west, east, or any which way. Collect a Jamal with a bell toy. Oh, she looks terrified. Considering she's up against a Tyranitar, I'm not surprised. Just eat you whole. Goodbye, Collector Jamal. Look at Ladybug. 
We don't want you. Lady bars are useless. Is this a... Ooh, we got a claw fossil. And we have a spinder. Like a yo-yo ninja. Get back on our bike. Another ball picks. We'll get away from you. Vela Lakefront. A Magnazone. Well, that's a super neat design, I like it. Rock Smash. Rock Smash. Let's see if I can catch it. Pokeball. Maybe. 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 Nope. Yeah, I've got great balls. Actually, we'll, we'll do a couple more. Hey, Density, what's up? this thing do an actual attack yet though oh there we go there's an attack just surviving good enough sometimes it's good enough All right, I'll try one more pokeball and then I'll just kill it I don't need the Pokemon, I just want it. Nope. Alright. Time to get obliterated. You refuse to come quietly. Or you shall perish. Goodbye, Magnazone. Switch out our Tyranitar. Alright, Cadaver, you're up. What's this? The Pokemon of the lake won't come out if it senses people. We're laying in ambush for it here. Oh, I see an item up there. And a Flygon. a good Pokemon, but not for today. We get a wave incense. Sure. Ooh, Suicune. Wild Suicune. Um, if we can't catch a Magnazone, there's little chance that we can catch a Suicune. And we get a C dot, and she's adorable. What am I to do? I've gone and dropped my sweet key somewhere again. The hotel people won't be happy with me. 
I'm sure I had it when I left the reception counter earlier. If I only had a Pokertech app dowsing machine, it'd be so easy to find. Alright, so we need the dowsing machine. Which is somewhere. There we are. Hello. Stop, stop. Yes, you. Sunny Shore City, which is down this road, but a major blackout. Crews are working on restoring power, but the road's closed now. Yes, don't lose uh, hotel room keys. We got, we got nothing. Nope. Me, I'm just a simple guy. I let my guitar do all my talking. All I need is music and Pokemon. I can shine wherever I go if I have those things in my life. I hear there are guys like me who go around Pokemon centers. Let me gaze into your eyes. I will read your fortune. An unseeable accident lurks. Whether you succumb to it or rise above, it all depends on you. We're a traveling troupe of street performers. In place of a formal introduction, please take this. TM92. Trick Room is a doozy of a weird time twister move. Use it for a while afterwards, the slowest Pokemon move first, before the faster can move. The slowest gets to attack. How you use this move is up to you, trainer. Although I think the randomizer is gonna be like, nah, that's not a Trick Room. That is a, another Meditate. Sure, thank you, I guess. Is that right? You're a traveler? Yes. It's good to see other places. Have you heard of the Whirl Islands in the Johto region? The silver colored Pokemon. I must see that during my lifetime. I'm sorry, but no Lugia for you. I'd rather be in a pool than the sea. The salty tang of the sea tastes like my tears after a hard day at work. Hey, Lavender Boss, what's up? You get a Macho Brace? I assumed he's talking about Lugia because silver Pokemon in in uh, in the Well Islands was there was a Lugia there. Hi, I'm the game director. Oh, you're working to fill your Pokedex. Hope you'll come to show me your Pokedex when you've filled it up more. Yeah, good luck on that. Uh, hotel room key? No. Where, 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 where you be? the reception counter earlier. Was this the hotel? There's a restaurant. Is it in here though? Nope. At our restaurant you can enjoy more than just exquisite dining. May also partake in battles. Bon appetit. How can you guess right about everything all the time? 
Do you really have the power of premonition? I'm convinced that he has some extrasensory power or something. I'm teaming up with a guy like that. Are you sure you want to do this? Yeah, yeah, I'll beat him up. Yeah, Kendrick and Beauty Gabriella. We get a Victory Bell and a Pidgeo, a Politoed. So we'll Psybeam the Victory Bell. And switch Pokemon to Dialga. Not Dialga, Salamence. The other, other dragon. Alright, Victory Bell gets one shot. Level 29 Quilava. Deborah's confused, that's fine. And headbutt the Politoed. Side beam and headbutt once more. Nice crit. Saved as a turn. And there we go. Beat up you two and take all your money. Eugene, I think you're a little awkward. But you're very earnest. If I team up with my date, it could be an interesting combination. I think we could battle in an intriguing manner. Do you? Yes. Collect a Eugene and a Roma Lady. Someone else. Allison. An Ursaring and a Baneri. Oh, they will lose together, for sure. Now let's team up on this Ursa Ring. As cool and fierce as she looks, I don't want to deal with it. Because that's a thing. Yep. Ursaring just managed to one-shot my, my Kadabra. Take your lunch money. You there? Yes, this meal is good enough to serve at a hotel. Please, don't tell my date that my father owns the restaurant. I'll have a battle with you if you keep your mouth shut. Alright. I'll battle you, I'll take your money. Rich boy Roman? And Lady Kylie. With an Arbok and a Torterra. The Arbok is looking pretty sexy. We'll bubble beam the Arbok and go we'll fly on the Torterra. <laughs> Convention terror. Oh, you got a crit on my Kingdra, you jerk. You're a meanie butt face. I'll 
Headbutt the Torterra and Dragon Breath the Torterra. Get out of here. Can you stop with the crits? That'd be fantastic. With headbutt and a metal claw. Try it again. Full restore. That's mean. There we go. Got them dunked on. Level 30 Kulava. Oh, you had a spear arrow as well. I'll give you a bite and a metal claw. <laughs> Pitiful mirror move. We'll take your big money. 8,000 pokey monies. So I'm going to go heal up. We'll toss out a teleport. And we will fly back. He's got fly. Yoga has fly. Uh, I can't fly here. So I'll get on my bike and ride back. Scoot down. Thankfully, it doesn't take too long when you're on a bike. Unless you go the wrong way and press the wrong buttons. Another glacier. Hey, Worlds, what's up? Uh, I haven't played the new Pokemon yet. I haven't had time to. But I am looking forward to playing it. I am currently playing a modded version of Pokemon Platinum. Where all the sprites are now cute girls. So I'm pretty sure I've checked everywhere I can with the dowsing rod in this area. Nope, not down here. This hotel is so romantic. I hope a night on a Pokemon will sweep me away for a honeymoon here. Ah, hello, you wish to stay a night? Ah, but you've no reservations. I'm afraid we're totally booked. You may rest a while if you wish. Right, I flew back for nothing. Um, I get fully restored here anyway. Thank you. Oh, we got a stretch. Let's check. Hang on. Uh, uh, uh. 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 Alright. 
Sitting up straight. Arms are stretched. Wrists are stretched. Back is stretched. We'll finish off these battles in here. Whoa, so this is the main dish. Wowza. Let's get this filming done quick. So I can chow down too. You've been sniffing around a lot. Are you messing with our filming? Yes, I am. Daryl and Valerie. The Polywell and a Scyther. That Scyther looks dope. And... Bubble Wing the Scyther. Alright, that wing attack hurt. Um, if you could kindly not do that again, that'd be fantastic. Yeah, I'm not sure who did the mod, but I think they did a fantastic job. Especially since there's like close to 500 Pokemon in it at the moment. Cybeam the Grovile and actually we'll swap out so that Kadabra doesn't die. Alright, Dialga. And we'll toss out a Twister. You jerk! I deliberately swapped out so you wouldn't kill my kill my thing, and then you pursued it. You butt. So that's you two down. Take your money. Not feel bad about it at all. Oh dear. I wish you wouldn't. We're at a fancy restaurant. You want to analyze what's served? Oh, you're a trainer. I am. Come at me, bro. We've got Emilo and Kaylee. With a Shallus and an Aaron. This should be a should be an easy fight. We'll bubble beam the Aaron and Metal Claw the sh mm, Dragon Breath the Shellless. Goodbye, Aaron. I love the Shellless's uh, little hoodie. Very cute. Twister and Metal Claw, why not? There we go. Oh, you got a Charizard. The Charizard looks a little scared. As it should be. Goodbye, Charizard. I need a level on Kingdra. And Quilava. Lava wants to learn Swift. Sure, that's better than a quick attack. And a Gardevoir. Oh my. You're very cute. And we take their take their dignity and their money. Cheers, dear. Please don't start at 
analyzing what we just drank. Alright, so that's all of them beaten. Then we'll heal up again. We get a full incense. There, items here. Not that I can see. How about here? No? You there. Eh? Yeah, I can battle too. Bring it. Tuba Chelsea. The Dusk Girl. Um, yeah, this is a bad matchup. Let's go for Kingdra. Yeah, I was trying to look for the the room key that the person said that they dropped. I can't seem to find it, so I think I might just not bother. Goodbye, Dusk Girl. Isn't this nice? I love my inflatable tube. The tube of Jared. The print plot. Sybeam. A path near a suite. I'll go, I'll go have a look. After this fight. I love a Cadabra, what's the lane reflect? No, I'm good. And a Drapion. What is Drapion? Drapion's the dragon. That's fine. Oh no, Drapion's the next thing. I was thinking of Drogodon. Drapion looks sick. Too bad you're a poor. Oh, you're a dark type as well. Never mind. I was going to say, too bad you're a poison type and weak to my attacks. But that's not a thing. Because you are a dark type. So let's go with Tyranitar. Oh, English isn't your first language? Oh, rock slide. Japanese names for Pokemon. You get a spell sprout. Although for things like Bell Sprout, like that just could be any Pokemon really. There's nothing really signifying it as a bell sprout specifically. Now, so what's over here? Oh, this goes all the way down and around. Okay. Top up. You said it was near one of the paths 
near a suite? Door where I exited. Ah! We got a thing. There we are. Thank you very much. And we'll go return that. Oh, that's my sweet key. You found it for me? Oh, that's sweet of you. Thank you. Can you give me something? Thanks for helping me out. Here's something for your trouble. Ooh, a white flute. Is it a key item? Not a key item. White flute makes wild Pokemon more likely to appear. All right, I don't need you. Oh, okay, so we've got a bump TV. One moment. Dunk. You've bumped my TV. What have you done? Now all wonky. You have a wonked the lounge. I hope you're proud of yourself. I know I am. We don't need this tracker anymore. There we go. There's a fancy hotel in a fancy place with a fancy restaurant. The fancy restaurant's filled with fancy people who think of themselves as being too fancy to battle alone. Oh yes, I met them already. This rock appears to be a breakable. Would you like to use rock smash? Yes. TM <laughs> growl. There's something on this cliff. This big cliff here. My instincts tell me that. But how am I supposed to climb up? Let me demonstrate my technique. It's how this grown up battles. Cindy, the dust noir. And again, let's not fight that with a cadabra. All of these are cute. All of them, without exception. We'll bite them. Wait. Try the bite again. There we go. And another bite. Stop hurting yourself. I'm trying to flex my superiority here and you're making it difficult. Thirty-two Quilava. What's this house? Doctor Footstep. Pokemon are quite easily for me to read. I only need to see their footprints and their innermost thoughts are revealed to me. Are oh, you skeptical of my claim? Then let your cadaver walk in front of me, right here. From its footprints, I'll determine how it feels about you. 
Some wild Pokemon frown upon others for traveling with humans. They jeer at their that their caught Pokemon have forgotten the wild. But that view is mistaken. They have they have just never met a trainer who would be a great partner. A great partner like Moggy, in other words. Hells yeah. And that is what your cadaver thinks of you. Alright, thanks. I guess that's just a friendship checker. Um. Oh, it just ticked over to 5 o'clock, so it changed time. What? Now, just, just now. I was just about to reel it in. an onyx. We'll throw out a side beam at you. You're a tough girl, but no match for my cadabra. And a hippopotus. We'll throw out a side beam at you. Even though you just want to have a nap under your blanket. And we get a Plusle. Plusle is garbage. And as I say it's garbage, it then proceeds to dunk on me really hard. But I'll just dunk on it even harder. There we go. Alright, so let's fix up this TV. I'll we'll just adjust that back up. There we go. Did I fight you already? I did. Let's break this rock. Get Kadabra out of the front. Oh, that's just a tree. No one cares about the tree. Nothing on that rock. Take your wiggly plants and buy a papa berry. A rose berry. Another rose berry. And an agua berry. Alright, sign, what do you got? Astoria City. Anything in this grass? Nope. Oh, we got a legendary. Hello. A Heatran. throw a couple balls at it. I'll throw four great balls. Odds are slim that it will even shake, but I'll take a 1% chance here. shake not enough all 
Alright, we'll do one more Poke Ball. Nope. Alright. Murder it is. Ooh, critical hit. And you got an Omni Boost. Alright. Never mind. Alright, Salamence, you can finish it off. And Headbutt. Didn't even give that much XP. Footprints are left in the sand when you walk on the beach. Pokemon seem to enjoy leaving footprints as much as people. Thank you. Listen, you know about the Battle Frontier? I do. I guess you're someone who in the know. I hear it's a fun place with facilities for battling th through under different sets of rules. Thanks for telling me about it even though I told you I already knew about it. Alright, what do you got? How do you there? Let me examine your Pokemon to see if it's worthy of a scarf. Hmm, I see. This isn't what I'd hoped to see. I can't lie to you, so I'll have to tell you straight. This Pokemon's not bad, but it's not good either. It's just so-so. You want to improve this one's condition? Feed it some Polphins. My brother's girlfriend is the message girl in Veilstone City. They stay in touch by having Pokemon hold mail for each other. I will win all the competitions. But also none because I won't participate. I'm visiting here to see the Great Marsh. I'm staying at the Lakeside Hotel. Marsh? Grr, this package hasn't arrived from Valstone Warehouse yet. I have to wait here until then. I'm going to go batty from this wait. Oh man, I wish I could do something that involves lots of explosives. Yep, this is going to be a smashing job for Team Galactic. Do you have an umbrella hat? You're just a totally impatient boy I met earlier. Just like you, he was very close with his Pokemon. Hey, thanks for making me smile. This might just put a smile on your face. Try dressing up a Pokemon with this white fluff. Thanks, I guess. Some trainers deliberately prevent their Pokemon from evolving. They wait until the Pokemon levels up and learn certain moves. Yeah, I'm good. On top up. Actually, let's save because we haven't done so for a while. And I'm going to take a quick drink. in this house. In the Great Marsh, quick trams on rails are used for transportation. They prevent damage to the Great Marsh's ecosystem. Though the name says quick, their movements are anything but. They're the quick trams that traverse the Great Marsh. Or maybe they were, they are the quick trams compared to the slow trams. Astoria's gym leader is awesome with his water attacks. You'll know what I mean when you challenge him. Oh, take these prism berries. A nanab berry. Another nanab berry. And another prism berry. Hmm. 
here where I am standing. I'm smack dab in the middle of town. This town's pretty spread out. Everyone calls me Pokemon Move Maniac. I prefer Move Tutor. I know every Pokemon that Pokemon can learn while they're leveling up. And I can teach Pokemon these moves. I can teach your Pokemon. Teach a move to your Pokemon of yours if you'd like. Trade me a heart scale. Oh, that's it. That's an honest to goodness heart scale. Let me guess. You want to teach me one of your Pokemon a move? Pokemon is tutoring. Um, I don't think any of these need tutoring to be honest. Let's see what Salamence can learn. What move should I teach? Actually, Thunderfang would be wonderful. Okay, you can learn Thunderfang. Uh, you can learn that instead of... And then instead of Bite. There we go. I often go to Solus Town for my big brother. The newspaper there gives me heart scales for running errands. Have you been to the Pokemon Mansion on... It's on Route 212. The owner, Mr. Backlot, likes to brag about his herd of rare Pokemon. Couple more great balls. Let's get 15. Buy some more super potions. Buy some more revives. More paralyzed heals. There we go. That'll do. I study rare Pokemon that appear only in the Great Marsh. I've been hiking all around the Sinnoh region. I love planting berries wherever I go. I'll give you a berry too. Plant it somewhere. A Cobra Berry. My sister gathers berries every day. Please come visit again. We cook the berries too. We mix them up. They're yummy. Alright, so that's the next route. Is this a... Surely there's secrets here. Well, there is. Like there. A lava cookie. That's a soggy lava cookie. It was in the puddle. Great Marsh keeps the weather cool in the summertime. This is a good town for water type Pokemon. Hey, have you caught both female and male forms of Combi? We have. I want to see both of them together. I'll give you a Macho Brace if you do. Deal? Pokemon Combi is quite interesting. Only the female evolves and grows strong. The male does not. Come to think of it, my wife was awfully strong too. She evolved from my bride to the mother of our kids. Are you saying that you're a weak man? So let's go gym. Hello there. Whoops. <laughs> I'm not always going to plow into you every time we meet. So how's it going, Moggy? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out to see how buff and tough you are. Suddenly rival attack, yes. Pokemon trainer chips. With a Taylo. Level 34 Taylo. Okay. Rock slide. Nice. And a Snova. 
So this is a job for cool lava. For sure. And flame wheel. Nice one shot. Keep the one shots coming. Celio. Good thing I picked up a Thunderfang. And Thunderfang. Oh, you've got Aurora Beam. That's that's bad for me. Cadabra, just hit it hard with a good attack. I said hard, hard would have been better. Could you, could you stop killing me please? There we go. Level on Cadabra. And Kulava. And we get a Blissey. Uh, I ran into how you can deal with a Blissey. Level 36! Smash. Rock smash. We'll smash this blue into smithereens. Get wrecked. Ooh, dark pulse. You know what? You can have that instead of Thrash. Gives you a special move in case you need it. And Pokemon Trainer Chips has been defeated. Heh, <laughs> yeah, maybe you did get a bit tougher since the last time. That even shocked me a bit, so yeah. I got beat because I was careless. Oh yeah, I joined Mr. Wake as an apprentice. Like, I want my own theme song. Alright, so let's go heal up. Oh, we can't change the poke attack. I'm gonna wait. There we go. Alright, Jim. The gym leader Wake, uh, I mean Crash Awake, is a master of water type Pokemon. I'd say you've got the guts to, if you try to face down water types with fire or ground type Pokemon. But that part I'll leave up to you. Go and leave some good battles. Actually, we'll save again. We've seen 110 Pokemon. Nice. You there, fight me. My body isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here. I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit. Tuba Jackie. With a Kyogre. Alright, we've got a Kyogre off the bat. Uh, Dialga.
and Dragon Breath. Oh, we got the Paralyzed, nice. Actually, if I use Fly, it'll waste his moves. Nice, nice Paralyze. Alright, easy done. Just crit, easy fight. Turns out if you just slam legendaries against a legendary, you're not in a bad position. Ooh, that drained the water. I guess we'll go down. Oh, the stairs here, I'm dumb. I wield the stupendous power of water. Don't think you can win. Fisherman Walter with a gore beast. Yeah, for a, for a randomizer, it seems awfully fitting that it's randomized it into other water types so far. Alright, so we'll, we'll Thunder Pack. Salamance is awesome. Goodbye, Gorbis. Your mermaid tail will save you no longer. Don't press the button. Come around. I've been around the world, going from place to place, training Pokemon. It's this gym I've chosen to make my home. You can bet it's tough. Can it not be another water type? That'd be great. Sailor Damien with a Burmy. That is not a water type. Hey, Doctor, what's up? Let's keep it protect. Oh, I got the double protect off. You jerk. But you shall not protect a third time. You will get dunked on by a Tyranitar. A Latios. This thing's got a Latios. stats 91 attack 59 special attack so alright use protect again we'll bite ooh almost one shot it the sandstorm finishes it off that was the easiest Latios of my life. Level 34 Quilava. And we'll come down this way. We'll come across here. I want to become a strong trainer like Crash Awake. Of a Caitlyn with a Marchamp. Alright, Tyranitar, you need to not be here because you are four times weak to that. Let's not do that. Alright, Salamence, you should be fine. 
You are a flying type after all. And... Headbutt. Nice crit, nice crit, with a flinch. Hey Sabat, what's up? How you doing? This is a Moemon, where all the Pokemon are cute girls. And I approve greatly. A Rattana. Uh, let's switch in the, the, the Tyranitar again. Salamence is almost dead though. I'll bring out one that's not dead. <laughs> one shot, nice. I'm gonna Munchlax. Ah, oh, she's adorable. I'll outbite her though. We've got the flinch. Yes, you do, Density. Yes, you do. We fix up our Salamance. Let's do it again. And let's switch you in. Try and get some more levels on you. I've landed the most fish Pokemon in the world. I'm next. Fisherman Eric with a Minetra. Yeah, that outfit just looks like a casual, comfy outfit. We'll throw in a headbutt. And get paralyzed by the static once again. Uh, we'll finish it off with an Ember. There we go. And we get a level on Salamence. The Mudkip. Mudkip, Mudkip. Uh, I don't have a grass attack. I guess Salamence will be fine. I'll just use headbutt. Koopa! Hey Sabat, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the lounge, you are now a sofa loafer. Can, can you, can you stop? Thank you. <laughs> Survive on two. Star you, I will switch because paralyzed and two hit points is not a good combination. Uh, Dialga, you got this. Uh, if you could catch cute girls from a fishing rod, like, wouldn't you try it? Fisherman Eric is down. Take his money. Actually, I've got Moo Milk somewhere. There we go. And Paralyze Heal. No worries, Rainy. Enjoy your dinner.
Yeah, I can't go that way. I have to go this way. Like the raging sea, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll. See, even if you just catch the bug types, the bug types are still here. A Rema Raid. It will Thunderfang you. And a Cleffer. Oh, you're in for a world of hurt. Um, because it's a randomizer, we've got all the Gen 1 through Gen 4. Um, yeah, everything Gen 1 through Gen 4. This Clef is destroying me, though. There we go. Screwed that Clef up. Smooch him, that's fine. Actually, I'm dumb. Not fine. The nice type. Means I bring out a king drop. Um, so there's uh, the Butterfree line, there's the Beedrill, um, Venomoth, uh, Insa. Scyther, Burmy, um, more. There's it, it, a lot of bug types. Actually, can I search by bug type? By type? Bug. Have, have there been no bug types? Right. Like these things are bug types, right? Ah, oh, because I haven't caught it, it doesn't know what type it is. But yeah, there's Cricketot and Cricketoon. Uh, got Burmy and Wormadam, and then Motham, and Silcoon, Beautifly, Dustox, Combi, Surely there's more. I do like the artillery though. Nice. Uh, what other bugs have we got? Uh, Cofrigus is a Gen 8 Pokemon. Oh, here's the Scyther. Scyther looks pretty sick. See, if I caught a bug Pokemon and this was what popped up, I'd be okay with this. Oh wait, Cofrigus was... wasn't Gen 8. Um, Cofrigus, I think, was Gen 6. And then had an ultimate form in Gen 8.
The water rising and falling is tricky, but don't let it annoy you. If you lose sight of yourself, that's when, you, when you're set to lose. Oh, this just runs back to the start. No. Uh -oh. I've I've made a mistake and I need to have to redo the puzzle. Let's try again. Um, maybe. I'm right back at the start. I am not a smart man. But since we're here, let's duck out and go say, uh, heal up. We'll heal up. And let's go to gym. Let's see if we can fix this mistake I've made. And we will bring this back up. And bring you back up. Dash around. Drop you. Oops, that's not what I meant to press. We need this one. I'll dash back up. Around. And bring it all the way up. And gym leader. We'll save. Welcome. I didn't get challenged. I don't get challenged very often. The glory you are now beholding is the Pistoria gym leader. That's right. I'm Crash Awake. My Pokemon were toughened up by stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours. Come now, let's get it done. Lead awake? You're not wearing a shirt. How are you, Deuce? There's another good looking bug. We'll throw an ember at you. Alright, I can't switch. Ah, uh, hyper potion, okay. That's okay. Duck a punch, that's fine. Hey, we got the burn right at the very end. And it killed it. Level 35 core lava. Wants to let him love him. And let's see what lava plume does. Ooh, that's good. Ah, uh, that is better than ember.
Oh, it's a Groudon. Does it let me switch out for the Groudon? It does. Okay. Oh, and he's done a drought. All right, change of plan. Let's bring in the Tyranitar. Because then it gets rid of the drought weather. And we will bite it. Oh, you're boosting. Alright, we need the special damage. Can you stop bulking up, please? If you hit me, it's going to really hurt. Yep, and you're faster than me. Right, so I'm going to revive... There you are. We'll revive the Kingdra. And Dragon Breath. Oh no, I think I might wipe here. The Ball Cups did not do well. Alright, let's do Dialga. I think it got three or four bowl cups off. Alright, hopefully it tries for another bowl cup. Nope. Dead Kingdra. Kingdra. Uh, Dark Balls. Groudon is so bulky. Oh no! It's got a hyper potion. Alright, go for another ball cut. Please. Nope, alright, take Kingdra. get a confusion nope dead cadaver yeah this is definitely a white Let's restart that. Groudon was so strong. Right, um, I forgot what the uh, first one was a grass type. So I'll switch into Salamence. is really strong. Oh, sorry, it wasn't a grass type, it was a bug type, but same thing, five moves. Flame wheel. 
Nice hit, nice hit. You will forget that. Oh, I've got Defog on Quilava. Wait, is it Defog that removes status moves? So first thing I need to do is switch in Tyranitar and then switch in... Yeah, because I need to switch in Tyranitar to get rid of the, the heat weather. Ah, oh, that's right, it's only for... Um, yeah, it's hazards, my bad. But that's okay. It didn't, it didn't start bulking up from turn one this time. Alright, that's one bulk up. Another bulk up. Oh, good crit, good crit. Live. There we go, double crit. So that second crit didn't actually matter. First one did. Alright. A polywag. I'll take a polywag after that. Uh yeah, okay, you can do a polywag. And dragon breath. A <laughs> belly drop. That was on anything but a polywag, that could be terrifying. And low off a Dialga, and we defeat the gym leader. And we'll take your money. Alright, we got there. Seems the undertow pulled me under, but I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. While we received the Fen bed from Wake. You need that Fen Badge to use the Hidden Mood Surf outside of battle. This is a special reward from me in recognition of your team's power. TM at 55. Contains the move Torment. It inflicts double the damage on the targets with less than half their HP left. Use it to end battles decisively. I don't know, he had something on me before with that Groudon. That Groudon, my goodness. No way, I've already battled you. Oh, hey. You got the gym badge here, huh? What did I tell you? Mr. Wake, I mean, the Master. It's pretty awesome, hey? <laughs> it's, that's, the, that's the wrong timeline. You're correct, we got it first try. What's this racket then? Oh, it's you two. Oh, master. Oh, master. Listen, kid. I know your father. I won't deny that. But I don't recall ever taking you on as an apprentice. Not in the least. Besides, you two don't need me. You can become strong on your own without being my apprentice. It doesn't matter. I made you my master. I decided. But forget that. There's trouble brewing. There's a Team Galactic goon in front of the observatory gate. He said something about a bomb. What? No one messes with Pistoria. Not on my watch. Hey, master, wait. I think we're in timeline C at this point. Because uh, Palkia destroyed us at Gym 2. Uh, so we'll switch you out.
Hey, what am I, chopped liver? Don't forget I'm here too. So where's this galactic... Well, that was wrong. You, what have you done? What have I done? You're asking? Well, technically speaking, it wasn't me. The package that arrived, see, that, that was a bomb. Named the Galactic Bomb. Me? I was told to push the button, so I did. Like, wink. Oh, that's right. Mustn't forget. The test results need reporting. Cheerio, then. You daft codger. Your mask's absurd. The Great Marsh is invaluable. You two, do not follow me. Don't let anyone else in either. There'd be big trouble if there was any of that bomb left. Hey Moggy, you go after the Galactic Goon. I'm staying here like Master said. Gotta keep the others from going in. Don't let the Galactic guy get away. What's the matter? Why aren't you gone already? Go after the Galactic Goon. Alright, he won't even let me in, gotcha. Hey, Galactic Goon. Wait, who's the dick? Is it this, this Galactic Goon or, or my rival? What's with you? Stop chasing me. I have half a mind to pulverize you with my Pokemon. But I have to be on my way with the lake ASAP. So, you're lucky. I'm out. Alright. Go make myself clear. Don't you dare follow me. Well, if I can't follow Galactic and I can't follow Crush Awake, it doesn't leave me a lot of options. Alright, I'm going to follow the Galactic Grunt. Alright, so this dude's the dick. We needed the energy from this Valley Windworks to make this... It wouldn't it would take a scientific genius to make something like this therefore our boss who made this is a scientific mechanical genius Gra, you were eavesdropping i was just thinking out loud but i'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around it's all right to have typos Man, this guy legged it. But boy, that this galactic bomb packs a pretty big wallop. With this baby here, there's not much we can't blow up. I wonder. I wonder what they have planned for this. Gra, you were eavesdropping. I was just thinking out loud. You're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away. But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. I know, right? I'm like, I'm like literally breathing down his neck and he doesn't even notice. Hello, friend. The cargo the Team Galactic brought is worrisome. So I have come. You say the cargo, it was a bomb? And there was an explosion? The explosion was at the Great Marsh? Furthermore, you are pursuing a man. A man with a funny bowl cut hair. In an outfit that is very strange. In other words... That is Team Galactic. Oh no, no, no. How did I miss it? Ah, looker. This time you have made a mistake of the ages. The man who I've been seen running away? He was the bearer of the bomb. Ugh. This will not do. Wait. Wait, I see. Ah, my friend, it is you. Yes, I am at this hotel now. I am intervening, interviewing the people to see if they have seen anyone suspicious. I would like your assistance. Go search outside, if you will. The suspect, he may have already slipped away ahead unnoticed.
Now if you keep the profanity down just a smidge, there's a bit on the over the top side. Pant pant. Why am I running like this anyway? Is that a new world? The new universe? That our boss was talking about? It's making me giddy thinking about it. When we use this thing. Well, you're eavesdropping. I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running. But I'm not going to battle you. Now, I don't know why auto mod detected got. Right, let's. Let's. Auto mod stop. Oh no. You're still on my tail. The legs within sight. You leave me no choice. My Pokemon will KO you. Oh, it wasn't even hyped. It was definitely got that it flagged. G O T. I have no idea what's wrong with that word. So, auto mod, you don't. Little headbutt. Nice flinch. Hey, you slapped me. Quit it. Headbutt. Can you, can you wake up, please? There we go. Finish off the spinder. That's all you had? You had a spinder and that was it. You had nothing but a spinder. I can't battle anymore. I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I got used to it at the lake. Well, if Spinder didn't suck so much, maybe I wouldn't bully Spinder so much. Oh, hello. Long time no see. How's your Pokedex filling up? I came to research the folklore about the lake, but... Well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there's an island inside the lake. And inside that island is a mirage of, po of a Pokemon. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Oh, that's right. I had to talk to you about something else. Hey, Moggy. Where'd that Galactic Groon run off to? Huh? Is this your older sister? No, she isn't. Oh, okay. That explains the Great Marsh. It wasn't anything serious. Mr. Wake told me to tell you that. But that... But that Team Galactic, wow. Are they out of control or what? Next time I see them, I'll teach them a lesson they won't forget. See you around. He's your friend? He's more impatient than he is energetic, isn't he? So getting back to what I started saying earlier. Have you seen the group of Psyduck on Route 2, 210? I did. Yes, that's right. By the cafe on 210. You've seen that group of Psyduck huddled with their heads in their ha uh, hands? Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on the Psyduck. You're working on a Pokedex, so it would be worthwhile for you. Got a secret potion. I went on a big adventure with a Pokedex when I was younger. I hope you get to meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. It may help you with the secret of the Mirage Pokemon. See you later. Uh, Team Plasma is definitely more evil than someone bullying a Spinder. Spinder deserves to get bullied for how bad it is. Uh, so we need to fly. Bring out 210. Alright, so that's here. Well, I guess I can't be one of your homies then. Because I do not love or support the spender. It is a Pokemon that is useless and out outmatched by every other Pokemon. Well, 
We'll get on our bike and go feed the Psyducks their medicine. That being said, I don't hate Spinder the most. I don't like Megas. Yeah, hey, Chin Chow. I'm quite happy with there being no Megas. Uh, I would have liked Megas a lot more if they did it for every Pokemon. Or if they did it for all the Pokemon that actually needed it. Instead of giving... Um, Charizard two Megas and giving Legendaries their Megas. Like, the Pinsome Megas, that, that was fine. Z-moves were dumb. I did not like Z-moves either. The Psyduck are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move. Would you like to use the Secret Potion? You use the Secret Potion. The Psyduck appear to be cured of their chronic headache. And they just leave. Oh good. You used the secret potion I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headaches, but no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh yes, can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there are some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so it'll be worth your while to go. Yes. My grandma has this sort of bossy atmosphere about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yes, I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. In the location? Look on your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm carrying on you. See you again down the road. Yeah, when they started making Megas out of all the Pokemon, I was just like, N nah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. Ooh, I see, I see an item. Hey, look at this beadrill, look how awesome this beadrill looks. Um, all right, I'll, I'll, th I'll, throw, I'll throw one Pokeball. I can't do an attack because all my attacks would kill it. Alright, no beadrill. Uh, maybe a cart might make it live. Okay, okay, we'll do we'll do another one. All right, great ball, go. All right, we'll do one one more, and then and then we'll move on. She's an independent woman. She doesn't need no man. But I won't kill her either. Oh, we've got a legendary. An Articuno. We'll get away from you. Trying to catch a legendary, another wave incense, alright. Trying to catch a legendary with great balls and no status conditions is near impossible. Another beadrill. That was two steps, can you stop? 
shell gun. Alright, do I have a repel? Not sure where repels are kept. I think I have a repel. Yeah, the Shogun is a bit lackluster in design. Oh, I went past it. Ninja Boy Brennan with a Manaphy. Of course, you've got another a, a mythic Pokemon. Thunderfang you. Look, I'm blind, right? I don't see things. Alright, your bubble beam is useless. No, people are allowed to have their favourite Pokemon, it's fine. As long as that favorite Pokemon isn't a Ladybug. Ladybug is garbage. Lava just dunks on that. And does Cool Lava evolve? Yes! We get an evolution for Cool Lava. Typhlosion. So we'll take that item off. Because now your stats are good. Yeah, got good stats now. Kingdra's stats are all average. Alright, cool. Let's see if I can find that repel. Do that going over it this time. There we go. I am one of the ninja trio. Being discovered means I must battle. Smoking looks pretty cool. Although, it looks like that top is barely staying on. That is quite open at the front. Thank you, Dion. You get a level on Salamence. And a Tentacruel. But no, I was paying a lot more attention this time because I knew it was there because you told me it was there. When you said that I passed over, I was like, alright, alright. Pay, pay more attention, don't just skim over it. Yeah, I missed. There we go. Let's get some Tyranitar happening. And a metronome. We'll fight you. 
I'm one of the ninja trio being discovered means I must battle. And how did you discover me? Don't tell me you're a ninja too. Ninja boy Bruce with a <laughs> the Dragonite. Ooh, that Dragonite looks nice. I approve of this Dragonite. And you've got Dragon Rage, okay. And you dodged my rock slide twice. Three out of five Dragonite. I don't know. I'd give it a four out of five. Now where's my Moo Milk? There's my Moo Milk. There we go. Aqua Tail misses. I'm gonna bite. Alright, Aqua Tail hurts a lot. But we beat it. Good solid dunking. We'll grab this item. Max Potion. Oh, repel while we're off. Alright, so we've got Fog. He's got Defog. You have Defog. There we go. And we'll put in our Kingdra. I can see the hidden move. If I could use the hidden move Defog, you clear up this fog so I can see. How does Defog work? Don't bird and bug Pokemon flap their wings to blow the fog away? Hello. Hey Rainy, welcome back. I am doing good. While you are still struggling to recover, I'll re already be the winner. Ninja Boy Joel. With a Bidoof. Like this, this Bidoof design definitely one-ups the, the default. Oh, you got Hyper Fang. Didn't do much. I'm okay with Bidoof looking good. Bidoof looks great. Oh, Weezing. I love Weezing's design in this one. Weezing is dope. She's a pirate. A dead pirate. The Lumis. We have a bug. So I've not found a wild wheezing. I think the reason for the pirate is because of the skull and crossbone design on the wheezing itself. And they went with that route. Lumis is dead. And we get a low tad. He's got like a little sombrero. Mega Drain for one damage. Goodbye. We take your money. Chop down a tree. Oh, 
a netball. As an ace trainer, I have to take battles in stride and just stay cool and calm whether I win or lose. Ace trainer Elisa to the Minetric. Uh, let's switch ahead of this Kingdra uh, into Dialga. Yeah, beating up money for their beating up money, beating up kids for their lunch money is great. It's free money and an easy win. It's literally win-win for me. The kids, it's, for, for the kids, it's a lose-lose. But they're kids, so it doesn't matter. Goodbye, Minetric. And we get the march out. Cadabra can deal with that. And we Psybeam you. Not quite a one shot, but that's fine. Whoa, that hit hard. And I get the crit when it doesn't matter. Thank you, game. And we get a level on Kadabra. Recover? Nah, I'm good. And Azuril. Look how cute she is. And Thunderfang. You may be cute, but I am the alpha dog. But not a dog. I am a dragon. Let me take your money. Uh, where's the map? Okay, I'm getting close to the you know. Okay, let's top up just a bit. Salamence. And oh, that was the Tyranitar. And summon the Salamence. And we'll paralyze heal the Dialga. Double battle me time. Jen, watch this. I'm going to use everything you've taught me. Here comes the trainer. Zach, are you ready? Let's do this. Come at me. Double team Zach and Jen. With an Azelf and a Swallot. So you managed to get an Azelf, nice. A level 36 Azelf. Bubble Beam and Rock Slide. Azelf is very cute. We will Bubble Beam the Swallot, then we will bite the Azelf. And that kills the Azelf. We get a level on Kingdra. And we will swap out the Kingdra and bite the Swallot. Toss out a metal claw and a bite. Easy 
anyway. You seem to have lost the... the uh, you seem to have a lot of confidence. Let's see if it's justified. Ernest. The Dragonair. Alright, okay, okay. Uh, let's switch Pokemon. And Diablo can deal with you. You have a cute dress, but not enough to make me not kill you. And Dragon Breath. <laughs> Get one shot. Nice. And a Bronzong. Uh, Bronzong can be a job for Tyranitar. Now I'll use Bite. Nope. Oh, okay. Dark Pulse now. Because you are super boosting your defense. I can't run away, that's fine. What is easy easy bronze on fight? And we get a level 30 Tyranitar. And a Mime Junior. And bite. One shot. Goodbye, Mime Junior. Let me take your money. Alright, let's heal up again. Get a Surdy Pop. potions that I will never use inside battle. Get them used up. And we'll pop up Kingdra. There we go. Fight me, Ninja Man. Black Belt Adam with a Soul Rock. You look like a little wizard, a little fire wizard. But I will bubble beam you all the same. Can't use items anymore, that's fine. And goodbye, Soul Rock. But, but my buff physique. Well, maybe you should have buffed your Pokemon instead of your own. Oh, hello, Ninja. When ninjas appear where you least expect us. Correct. Did not expect to see you there, to be honest. Ninja boy, Nathan. The Monferno. There are ninjas all over this place. And Monferno is down. What else you got? Level 30 Kingdra. And I want to learn Brine. Yes, please. Uh, you can learn that over Water Gun. Robat. Alright, Salamence, you're up. And 
and Thunderfang. And my last Thunderfang. Kills the Crobat, nice. And we take the kid's money. And we get a Black Flute. What is a Black Flute? Uh, Pokemon less likely to appear. So the White Flute increases uh, the chance to find Pokemon. The Black one decreases it. I'll teach you about the charms of bird Pokemon. Birdkeeper Brianna. The Porygon 2. I do like the Porygon 2's outfit. Very cute. And Brian to finish it off. A love disc. Uh, Salamence. You can just headbutt the love disc. And headbutt. I'm confused. That's that should be okay. Headbutt. No, stop hitting yourself. Headbutt. There we go. Now one more headbutt. And we get past the love infatuation and slam our head into the little girl. And we take our XP. What's low protect? I am good without that. And we take your money. Hey there, old man. Very well, I've decided. I'll battle one last time with you, then I'm retiring as a trainer. Alright. I'll make your final fight a, uh, a bad one. Veteran Brian. Electivire. Electivire looking dope. Alright. Nice crit, nice crit. Another crit that doesn't matter, that's fine. Level 30 Dialga. Dragon Claw, yes please. Uh, 80 power. 60 power. Uh, oh. A Cacnea. Oh, for sure. Dragon Claw is way better. The only thing Dragon Claw doesn't do that, that uh, the other one has is it's um, it removed my special attack from Dialga. But that was the the only consideration I had. Is like, do I want to keep a special attack on Dialga? The answer was no. The answer was I wanted Dragon Claw. Oh wait, I'm done. Uh, I need to do physical attacks against the Munchlax. And of course it is doing Yep. 
That's fine, that's fine. And we'll rock smash it. See, that's fine, because now you don't have the stuff piles anymore. And I just remove it all with one hit. Goodbye, Munchlax. And goodbye, Veteran Brian. Just as well that you're retiring as a Pokemon trainer because you did not much. Take that Citrus Berry. Take a Chesto Berry. And the Wiki Berry. And an Agua Berry. Now let's jump on our bike and go across the bike path. I'll fight you. Ninja can use all kinds of skills, like this and like that. Davido is an Arceus. You have Arceus and you're a ninja. My goodness. Ancient power. Can I get an Omni boost? Um. All right, Diago is down. Ooh, not yet, not yet. Now's the hour is the on. Oh, one moment, someone is at my door. Give me a sec. Alright, I am back. Uh, Arceus, you need to stop what you're doing. And just, just lay down would be nice. Alright, we've got gravity, that's fine. Hey, chill, what's up? How you doing? And that's a dead Arceus. For a butt ton of XP. Break this rock. We get aromatherapy. That's alright, chill. You're allowed to lurk. And as long as you enjoy yourself here, that is perfectly fine. And Pokemon Center. Let's heal up after Arceus gave us a bit of a, a thrashing. Old lady. What would compel a young person like you to come somewhere so rustic? Be sure to see the cave painting since you're already here.
and I've just seen the time and I've been going for two and a half hours so I'm going to save there and find someone to raid because I need to get some food Hey, Ashamiki, what's up? I don't quite understand what you're referring to. But we are just about to raid out and find someone to raid. Since we've got a few few family members here, let's raid into raid into into Gumi. Make sure I've spelled it correctly, because I do that incorrectly. I did spell it wrong. This is one of my VTuber siblings. Feel free to copy our raid message and let them know when we have arrived. And I'll remember to copy it as well. And if you want to know when I go live again, there are my socials. I'll be posting on Twitter and Discord when I go live and on the YouTube I will post all of my VODs from the very first day that I started every day until forever, I guess. So yeah, thank you everyone. Uh, next week I am having my live 2D debut and there won't be many streams until then. I will see you all next time. Have a good one and have a fantastic weekend everyone.